Hello, everybody. This is Dr. Dan Cartolicchio. We are going to do a testimonial today, Destination Health Podcast. And we have a very special guest on. You haven't been on for like six months or so, right? Yeah, it's been ages. It's been a long time since you've been on, right? What's up with that? How come you don't come on to our show anymore? I wasn't invited. What do you mean? You're my, you're my, (laughs) you're my client. Why wouldn't I invite you on? Oh, well, we had the summer and, you know. I think you said no a couple of times. And so. I don't I think, think so. <laughs> no, you don't think so. So anybody, everybody that's listening today, we are here with Nadine Moxon, not Nadine, Nadine Moxon. She is from Australia and she lives in Calgary right now, which is probably getting really cold in Calgary at this point. It's, right? to, it's okay today, but it is starting to chill off. And so. did it start snowing yet? Not here, not yet. But no? Far away. You sure? Okay, I heard. I heard it was snowing there, but Not we're going problem. to. We're, we're going. To, Nadine's been a uh, client now, and she is a figure professional, figure competitor, and uh, she had contacted us because she heard that we were okay in doing this, and she's ready to get back on stage. So we're going to be talking a little bit about this. So everybody, just hang in there for a few minutes, and let's get to know Nadine. So you lost fifty pounds so far with us. Yeah. You look, you look great. Thank you. I feel great. You you feel great. Listen, how were you before you started the program? Where were you mentally? Um, Really not in a good headspace at all because I tried, you know, kind of everything. And I'm well versed in the side of nutrition. I'm a coach. Um, So I, I, you know, tried the macros, calories, Mm -hmm. all that kind of stuff and nothing seemed to work. And I just kind of, I would lose maybe a pound or two and then, there'd be a plateau and I just knew something wasn't quite right. So my headspace was horrible because I'm a trainer. I should look like I'm a trainer. Um, it didn't feel great. Self-confidence was at an all time low. And I just, um, I felt like I didn't look like I should with the amount of work that I was putting into right. my, my health and my physique. So yeah, it wasn't, I wasn't in a good spot. That's for sure. And, and where were you physically before you started? Because uh, I posted one yeah, of the pictures you sent me. Yeah. See the facial in that photo? I <laughs> saw the facial in that photo. You were not happy no, in that no, photo. No. no, because I knew that that's not me. You know, right. that with how I was eating and everything, that shouldn't be how I should appear. But that's how that's, you, you shouldn't appear that way. So <laughs> let's go back. Tell us about yourself a little bit. Figure competitor. You've been in shows and so forth. As a matter of fact, I'm going to have um, I'm going to have them put up a picture of you when you were on stage. So unless you have unless you have one, send it to me before you before okay. you head out today. All right, yeah. and I'll and I'll and I'll put that up, you know, and and so that so that people can see it. So tell us about your career. Um, I didn't really get into fitness until it was probably my early 30s, mm-hmm. and um, just kind of dabbled a little bit. Mm-hmm. And then, um, you know, I remember I joined a gym and I'd had numerous trainers at that gym. And then I found one that I like I gelled with and I really enjoyed his programming. Mm-hmm. And um, I probably had three or four people come up to me in the gym in about the span of a week. And so, you know, have you ever thought of doing a show? And, you know, my response was, I'm not getting up in a bikini in front of all those people. It's not going to happen. And fast forward 20 weeks and Nadine's standing on stage in a bikini in front of all those people. And so, you're standing, um, in, you're standing in, in the stage in front of a bikini and everybody. That's great. Yeah. And we're going to get you back on stage. That's our ultimate that's goal. That's the goal. Yes. We're getting you back on stage. And how's your energy and focus right now since you've been on the program? Um, really good. I found in the beginning, um, the changes that I experienced were really, really fast. So I had a lot of brain fog. I had headaches all the time. Right. Uh, my energy was low. I wasn't recovering very well. My digestion was horrible. You know, I couldn't eat certain meals and I'd feel yuck afterwards. And I knew I was bloated and retaining water. So I just, I wasn't good. And um, I felt just hor- like I was existing. I didn't feel like I was living. And then I remember, I think I was on, like it was literally two days and I was sitting in my car and I was like, I don't have a headache today, which is great. And I felt the brain fog kind of lift, if that makes sense. So I just had more clarity 
with my thinking and um, it just, it felt really good. So I experienced those results super quickly. And then obviously, you know, the body composition changes once we um, dialed in my food and everything and figured out what was actually good for me, not good. Um, well, we did yeah. the food sensitivity test, so we yeah. found out what foods you should be eating, what foods you should you should should you be avoiding. What's your what's your body fat right now? Um, I don't even know the percentage. I didn't even look at the scalp. Just been looking at the weight. Yeah, we haven't. We haven't. I think Friday we're going to do a uh, body comp on you again. Oh, I tomorrow. Think I, okay. Yeah, I think I think tomorrow morning, and then and then we'll uh, we'll uh, post that. Okay, yeah. and and because I think there's comparisons on there. Totally. How's, your, how's your outlook right now on life? Because you're really, I mean, you're bubbly. Every time I talk to you, you're like, you're like, you know, you're just, just you're just bubbly right now. Sparkle. Um, I just I like that better. Sparkle instead of bubbly. Sparkle instead of bubbly. Um, yeah. I just I feel great. Um, obviously my body's changed the way that I've wanted it to, and I'm getting closer to feeling like I can prepare for a show, which was, you know, that's the end game. That's the end goal right. for me. Um, so I find I'm keeping up with my kids. I feel good. I'm not lethargic, no headaches. Um, everything's good. And I just think when you're in that place where your mindset's not good and you're not feeling good about yourself, things don't happen the way that they should. But since I think I've got more confidence and putting my, myself out there, like my whole, my whole life has changed. Um, business opportunities have come my way that has been things that I've wanted to do for years um obviously you know spending that quality time with my kids and stuff it's just great and then empowering people you know like women that can do this as well like anyone can do it you just gotta have the right honestly have the right coach the right roadmap and stick to it it's right and 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 you know to be to be discussed on another podcast soon soon nadine and i are are looking to do business and we're going to help those middle-aged individuals that need help when it comes to this, because there's a lot of us that are out there, you know? I mean, there was a commercial way back when I was growing up, not only am I the hair club president, but I'm a client too. I mean, I've had my health issues also that has brought Mm -hmm. me to this point and, and, and and the Dean knows those and we'll discuss them at another time. Where do you see yourself? Does in certain um, aspects of their life. I think, you know, it's, it's rare for someone to go through their life and not have intolerances to food or come, you know, like there's a time, I think there's a time for nearly everyone where the things that they used to do don't work anymore. And it can be related to hormones, the food they're eating or, or whatever. I just think it's a challenge for so many people. And in my experience, a lot of my clients are around our age. Um, they go to get medical help for this and they're told this is normal and suck it up. And it's not, it's not normal. It's not. It is not, it's not normal. And if I, I'm thinking of two or three friends of mine that are medical doctors that have been on my, that have been on my podcast. And if, and if, if they hear that from, from another doctor, they just get really, really, really upset. So yeah, it, it's, it's not, you know what, you're going to have the right tools. You got to have the right coaches, Nadine totally. and I, you have to have the right people in your corner, you yeah. know, between the both of us, I think we probably have over 60 years experience in the health and fitness industry. Boy, that's a lot. That makes me old. You know what I'm saying? Because you've only been doing this for a few years. Anyway, oh. all right. Where do you, where do you, Nadine, where do you see yourself in six months? Six months, I want to be starting a prep or into a prep. So I've used this year primarily just to relax my eating a little bit, see how I responded. Um, and I've responded really well. Like I've still stayed within a range that I've wanted to stay in. Um, and I think my body's at a happy place right now. And it's more importantly at a stable place where I can start to kind of put some pressure on it and, um, do a show because I think when you do a show, especially as you're getting older, cause things don't work the way they used to, um, you really have to make sure that your body's in the right place when you start these things. Mm-hmm. Um, otherwise, you know, I don't want those things to creep back in, to be honest. So, so anybody that wants to start the program, what would you say to them? What would, what, what would your it. advice be? Just do it. Just do it. Right. Just do it. Don't even think about it because no, you're just get it done because yeah, you know, it, it works. 
I'm proof of it. Yeah, I mean, not, not only not only does it work, it's scientifically scientifically backed. I'm a chiropractor. I got a master's in nutrition. I teach this at the graduate level. Uh, Nadine is uh, Nadine's going to be you know coming on board, and we're going to be doing stuff together very very soon. So we know you want to go on stage. You know we know this. Give me two other goals you want in the next in the next year. Oh, we're putting you on the spot now. You Tell me. Sure are. What yeah, well, is it physical or is it more anything you want? Doesn't have oh, to be physical. Anything. anything. Okay. Because so. when you because because when you're eating right, you got a better outlook, you have more energy, more focus. It's just that much better all the way around. Totally, totally. Um, I'm currently in the process of building my own website map. So mm -hmm. I would like to have that up and running and going. And um, I really want to start a foundation that helps with people with mental health. So I'm um, just working through the logistics of that at this point in time. So my goal is to have trainers that work with me in my business um, and then a portion of everything that's sold under my group uh, will be put into, into a fund just to help people with mental health. I just think, you know, the times, especially what we're going through now, it's not easy for... I have, I have the individuals for you to meet too with that. So. Oh, perfect. See? So I have the individuals. Yeah. So do I, do I have permission? Help as many people as I can. Do I have permission to share this with doctors, students, clients, anybody anywhere in the world? Totally. 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 Nadine, thank you very much. It's been a pleasure That's working with you. Thank you. The best is yet to come. Oh, yeah, it is. The best is yet to come. So we're very happy. You look phenomenal. Thank you. And I, we had a couple of people that were listening. Actually, we have a bunch of people that are listening right now. So if you have Hi, any questions, everyone. yeah, if you have any questions, put it in yeah. the comment. If you're if you're a little, you know, shy. You're going to wait till we get off in the next minute or two. That's okay. That's fine. And then what you can do is you can, um, you can uh, put it, you know, comment in there and you can uh, make sure, and we'll make sure that you get back. Andrea has just joined us. Ah, oh, Miss Andrea. Andrea, do you have any questions for Nadine or I? Because Andrea is on her journey. And, she sure is. and she's going to be coming on next week, by the way. She's coming oh, on next perfect. week and I'm going to be talking with her. I saw her photo and I can, it just, it was a, just a photo of her face, but you can see the difference. Like her eyes are bright and sparkly. Her sparkly and she, and she looks good. So everybody's and looking good, feeling good. Easy. Everybody ought to be in Hollywood. I got to get there now. So anyway, I want to thank everybody for listening in today. Thank you very much, Nadine. Um, oh, wait a second. She wants to know, are you currently doing weight training, strength training? If so, how often? Uh, strength training at the moment, I've bumped it up to five days a week because I have a special photo shoot on the 14th of October. Um, you so weren't going to mention that, no, but you're now you are. I'm not saying who with. Um, so I'm currently doing five days. So I'm working out five days Um I'm working, doing my strength training for around 40 minutes. And then I'm doing my morning walks, which have my lives in the morning. And probably next week, I may throw some cardio in um, just in the evenings, just, you know, 20, 30 minutes of, of something. So I respond better to strength training. Most people do, believe it or not. Um, it's important yes, to do strength kind of training. Focus Correct. Yeah. Correct. Yeah. Absolutely. And, and, and Andrea, she's been on the program. She just said that we can say she's lost 43 pounds on the program. Yay! So that's well awesome. Done. That's so awesome. So proud of you. Well done. Yeah, it's proud of her too. So she's doing good. And my cousin, Nancy from Florida has just joined us. Hi, Nancy. How are you? And uh, we're talking a little health and fitness today. And if you tell John, her husband, my cousin, uh, that I'm going to call him tomorrow because uh, he has some, he has some questions too. So oh, who knows? Who knows? Yeah. I may get I get my I may get my cousin John on the program some at some That'd point be awesome. too. We so do that it. would be good. So yeah. anyway, want to thank everybody for being here. I want to thank you, Nadine, for coming on. Uh, it's been it, it's been great working with you. Uh, look forward to 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 what's uh, in store for us, cool. and uh, the best is yet to come. Thank you for everybody. Live your best life, and we'll talk soon. Take care. You will. Thank you.